graphic extras. In this video, I'm going to show you the Stute Graphics tool Extend Path. It's part of the Vector Scribe set, and this is 2.1 now. It's moved on to 2.1. It's added a few new features, and the key one for me, anyway, is and I'm just going to go over to the Extend Path tool, just bring it up. Spiral option. There's all the previous options, single bezier, etc. But this one, spiral with winding constant. And you can obviously modify that. Also use various radiuses, batch radius, etc. Use fixed radius of. Right. Also, you can do the reverse curvature. Now, the layout of this preference is much nicer than the previous version. So just click OK at that point. And I'll just quickly show you that it can, you can just see straight away that it's got a, a path that's been extended from that thing. Really, really nice feature. Now, you can actually use it to create wonderful pattern designs. So I'm just going to go to Object, Pattern, Make. And there you have it. You've actually got the spiral design there, but you can still continue on with the extend bar. So I'm just going to click there. And you see the gain. It comes up with this little marker where it's just going to extend. Or you could go from there as well. So you just click there and you can just see it's just added. And there you have it. Now, of course, you don't have to stop there. You can actually go, and I'm just going to move that down a bit. So you can actually just see, oh, actually, I'm going to start from a complete fresh one. That's the easiest way. Another spiral design. And again, extend path. And it again puts that little marker there. And you can just see, that, modify that. Also, you can double click that. Brings up the options. And you maybe want to change that. You can go over here. Increase that a bit. Click OK. Maybe use the reverse curvature. So I'll click OK there, and it will spiral out that way. So just continue on. Spiral. Stop there. And there you have it. You've got a great tool for creating zillions and zillions of spiral designs. Now, of course, it doesn't have to be just spirals. You can just, of course, go over here. Say the arc tool. Just select there. And you can add that, of course, to your pattern as well, and use the spiral option again there. And you can see another spiral extended out, another spiral out that way. Right, there you have it. You can create thousands and thousands of different pattern swatches. Very simple, just save a copy, and there you have it. Hope you found this tutorial of interest. Thank you much.